Hey, this is the Birdman Coco Beware, the WWE Hall of Fame. And you are watching the Rubber City Wrestling. The real wrestling. Bird, 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 do the bird, bird, bird. Bird, 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 do the bird, bird, bird. Come on, y'all. Everybody get up. Everybody get down. You better stretch your stuff because the bird man's in town. Bird, 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 do the bird, bird, bird. One cameraman positioned in the ring. For an up-close and personal view. Studio Wrestling is back. RCW. Rubber City Wrestling. Presents to you. CW Global. Rubber City Wrestling. Real professional wrestling. Not that flippy stuff. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to RCW Global. I am Michael Voorhees. Alongside me, Corbin Shadow. Michael, we're here. Let's take it to the ring. All right, Corbin, first match of the night. Look who our special guest referee is, the one and only Jeffrey LaRoque. It's the Prince of Darkness, Black Sabbath versus Black Hawk. This is a good opening match to start the night. Is it, though? Black Hawk is super weight coming in with Black Sabbath? No, you know, I would not count out Black Sabbath at all, Corbin. I mean, maybe, maybe you should. I mean, he's throwing a temper tantrum at the moment as Black Hawk shoves him down halfway across the ring. Now they're just kind of staring at each other. I mean, I don't trust Black Sabbath. I really don't. I mean, he's he's wiry. You got to give him that. He, he's wiry. He is wiry. I mean, oh my goodness. Oh my. Back to back, back elbows. Now he drives Black Sabbath back into the turnbuckle. Now he's walking away. Oh, turn around. Oh, head of steam. Oh my goodness. Medivac on the horn. Oh my this goodness. Could be there it is. Black Sabbath. Wow. And there's the slam. One, two, and three. You could probably count to 100. Black Hawk, your winner. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. Hey guys, I'm Mike. And I'm Brent. And we are the hosts of a Swing and a Tribe podcast, and we're part of the Press Play Podcast Network. Yeah, we're really just a couple of fans who love Cleveland Indians baseball. So if you love the Tribe, please give us a listen. You can find us anywhere that podcasts are available. Mike, tell us where they can find us on social media. On Facebook, you can find us at a Swing and a Tribe MLB podcast, and on Twitter, at Swing and a Tribe. Go, Go tribe. tribe! RCW Rubber City Wrestling. Allow me to beg your indulgence for one moment. This is the fallen angel, Christopher Daniel. The blue. Mick Foley. And you are watching RCW Wrestling from the Rubber City. Rubber City Wrestling. Real pro wrestling. Not the flippy stuff. Have a nice day. Yeah. Catch RCW Spotlight Sundays at RCW Global. Thursdays only on the RCW Network on YouTube. All right, Corbin, it is time for the Thursday night throwback match of the week. The Top Guns, Die Hard the Hunter and Stingray versus the Andalini Brothers. Yes, all four of them. <laughs> My goodness gracious. I, every time I look, more and more Andalini Brothers come. I, I just, I, right, they're like the little Oompas that just keep coming <laughs> out of the little pipes. I guess so. <laughs> so in this match, it will actually be... Vincent and Sonny Andalini and Michael and Frankie are at ringside. I mean, look at this. I mean, the Andalinis travel in packs. You can never trust the Andalinis. We know this. We've seen it. We've seen it happen That's many true. times. I know that you are friends with all the Andalinis. I mean, they're um, good guys. They're straight up, you know, 
just die, like just straight up good guys. Uh, you know, you must be talking about a different family. No, look, see, right now they're they're patting down Vincent, the youngest, right? Just showing you, they're Sunny, tap, pat him down, straight and narrow guys. Right. Their last name is what again? Indeleed. Okay, you can't trust them. Just so we're clear, just so you and I are on the same page. Let's I mean, talk about the top guns. But, but, but here's the other thing. Yeah? I wouldn't blame them for trying because they're up against top guns. Yeah. Die Hard the Hunter and Stingray. Yep. Two very strong contenders. Yep. Well, obviously missing tonight, Guile Corey, Skylar Sinclair, and Mike Smiley, also members of the Top Guns. They're not here. So it is just Die Hard the Hunter and Stingray. So it's two versus four, ideally. That's right. never a good, those aren't I good mean, odds. I mean, you got to understand, this was this match right here. It was Die Hard's most heated rivalry in FCW. Aside from leaving it. Well, yeah. Who doesn't leave have a, an issue with? Me. <laughs> True. Okay. Because Fair I enough. call it as I see it. Fair enough. But you know what I'm super excited about? I know this is our throwback match of the night, but guess what's coming up on August 14th? Wait, wait, wait. Don't tell me. Because August 14th is the live event. Oh, my goodness. Not to cut you off. We just had a competitor go up over the top rope and onto the floor, Corbin. Wow. I don't mean to interrupt you, but go ahead. August 14th. August 14th, our live event in the Akron Turner Club, The Art of War. Yes, RCW is back. Live events are back. I cannot be more excited. Tickets on excited. sale. Have you seen my commercial yet? Are the you tickets are on sale. Yep, I knew you were upset about that. I had to take a little poke. Shout out again. This is the one time, you better mark this down, this is the one time that I'm going to give Rick Lee props, okay? He contacted me and asked me, since I am the voice of RCW, to provide the read for the commercial. So, well, thank you, Rick Lee. I told, he called me first. I said, uh, I said there you better it is. not call there me first. There it is. You better call Mike. Uh, you better call Michael. Well, I appreciate it. Oh, there's oh, a tag. Wow. And there's a clothesline. And down goes an Andalini. That's got to be, I think that's Sonny. That is Sunny in the blank that tank top. Sunny, oh, look out. Vincent. Look out. Oh, my goodness. Referee, he's going to have his hands full tonight. Oh, my. Sonny, the punch to the back of the head. And there's there's Frankie wearing the hat. Frankie? I haven't seen him in a while. We have not Are seen Frankie. See Frankie I, soon? I don't know. Ever since losing that, the global television championship, we have not seen Frankie. I hope he's well. I miss him. Right. I, I mean, I miss, Frankie, if you're out there, we miss you, buddy. Yeah, maybe come he'll come back. Maybe he'll come back. I don't know, but right now, die hard in a bad way here. Oh, oh my wow. goodness! Wow! My oh my! There's the replay. If you didn't see oh. it the first time, <laughs> it's just as bad the second time. That had to hurt. Yeah. Here we go. Oh, oh my goodness! But now, it is Vincent just taking the hit. No. Yeah. And that is Stingray sending across. Oh, Vincent, oh, Vincent wow. just got destroyed with that clothesline. My, oh, my, oh, oh my. The youngest Andalini brother. Yeah. We'll see if he gets to live as long as his brother. Stingray, also known, obviously, Stingray. I knew you knew this, the big Sting dog. We, we, we knew that. But Stingray, oh, oh my, wow. held him up there for a little bit, let all that blood rush to the head. And down he goes. My goodness, what a clothesline. Now he's up on the second rope getting some love from the crowd. He went to the wrong corner. No, he didn't. He's got Die Hard. Die Hard and Vincent now going at it. Sonny and Stingray going at it. Wow. My goodness, all four men I, in the ring. The, like I, I, I said, tell you, I don't even know who the official wrestlers are right oh now. Oh, my. Who's tagged in? Who's not tagged in? It, this is. There we go. Yeah. I think it is still Stingray. And Sonny, I think. It may be right. Vincent at this point. Right, but right now, all the Andalini brothers. Nope, there's... Oh, oh, oh what wow. a spear! What wow. a spear! Sting right down. Here's the cover. One. Nope, he is into the ropes and no pinfall, Corbin. All that for nothing. I think we see where the heated rivalry comes from. This is awesome. This is fantastic. Look at that. Another kick. Stingray is down. I mean, Vincent to the with the kick to the back. Wow, you got to give it up to Vincent here. I mean, just now he's on top of Stingray. Repeated 
rights and rights to the face of Sting right now. He's choking him. That's typical Andalini style right there. Got to bend the rules a little bit. It wouldn't make you an Andalini any other way. Was it a choke? Nah, it was a choke. Are you sure? That was a choke, yes. We're not going to get into schematics right now, but that was a choke. All I'm saying is, this camera view, that is a long way away. It is a long way away. Yeah, and I will say. The, the ref say. is right up there, you know. You gotta, you gotta let the ref do his thing. I'm happy that the quality has has improved over the years of uh, the camera. Here we go. Die Hard now staring at Sonny. These two want to tangle a little bit, and oh my, what a clothesline by Sonny Andalini! Just drops Die Hard to the mat. My goodness, now Sonny helping him back up. Oh my. Oh, oh my goodness gracious. Wow. I don't know what he calls that move there. Here it is again. Watch and oh my, oh. down he goes. Die Hard could be out here. That was some Frogger level stuff right there. It was. Oh, now there's an Andalini double both team Andalini's. here. Oh, oh, back elbows from both Andalinis. Vincent and Sonny followed up with elbows. I mean, Die Hard's in a bad place here. Vincent with the cover. One, two. Oh, and Stingray in to break it up just before the three count, Corbin. Got a little bit of a replay going on here right now. I mean, he's Stingray helping up. He's helping up Vincent. Now he's going to send him across. Look out. Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh my. Vincent taken down by Stingray. Follows up with a diving headbutt. Nope. Looks like he was there. You go. Corbin, I told you. You cannot trust the other two Andalini brothers while they're outside the ring. I don't know about that, but I do know August 14th. We're going to get to see this stuff play out live. Wow. I knew you would not want to talk about what we just saw. Give me a break. I mean, the Andalini's just pummeling both Die Hard and Stingray now. It is four on two, Corbin. Is it? It is four on two. Can is you it? see? Oh! That, that was a bowling shot. That was a bowling shot. Down the they go. My goodness. And here we go. Oh, it's going to be a double count out, Corbin. What a way to end our throwback match. A double count out. Rivalry continues. And there you have it, the Andalini brothers standing center ring, convinced they are the best. But right now, we're going to send it to Michael Voorhees with his interview with Schizo. Ladies and gentlemen, my guests at this time, the new RCW Neo champion, the Cloud Prince of Mayhem, Schizo. Welcome, Schizo. Why are you doing where, where would you like me to be? Away from me. Oh, uh, do you want the microphone? Oh, okay. I told you, Marcus. Give me what I want. I got this. But you didn't show everybody who you really are. So now, while everyone's out there scurrying to find you, just remember this, I know who you are. I know where you are. They don't, they'll never find you again. 
And for all the boys in the back that want this, be prepared to be sacrificed. Because Beelzebub and the hounds of hell are ready. We are ready. Anybody wants this, they have to go through me. Don't touch me! <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. And don't go anywhere. We'll be right back with the next match of the night. Hello and welcome to another edition of RCW Spotlight. Smells like ass and bad decisions in here. I love seeing you here. Well, I love seeing you too. Joe's yeah. sexuality was never in question here, right? Oh no. Did you really bring your participation trophy I gave you after our match? Yes, you just kind of watch who you're poking, man. No, I poked the bear. I wanted you to think I was still a referee. Adorable. I like when little dogs bark too. I said what I said. Yeah, oh. you said what you said. You were wrong. Oh, Get your head straight, right? Get your attitude right. You might know him as the guy that's staring at the lights during wrestling. Oh, that's all I know. Yeah, I'm joking. No, I'm joking. No, you know how I know? Because of science. Argue that. <laughs> this guy hit me in the head with a platter at the last show. You can beat this man at his own game. And he's upset about it. He can't handle loss. Well, now he knows loss. You are definitely my dream match. RCW Spotlight, Sundays at noon Eastern Time on the RCW Network. All right, Corbin, it is time for the next match of the night. This for the All-American City Championship. The champ, Miles Jacobs, the mean streak, Miles Jacobs. Right. Channeling his inner champion. Fight. He's going to fight against the high note, Brennan Martell. We have not seen Brennan for quite some time. This is awesome no. that he gets a shot at the title. Well, Brennan, as you know, is one half of the heavy metal heartthrobs. His yep. partner, DJ Squared. Went up to the Navy. Currently serving our country. Yes. Hey, uh, DJ Squared, I miss you, brother. Thank wish you for you, your service. Wish you nothing but the uh, best of luck, and hopefully we'll get to see you soon back in an RCW ring. I'm sure Brennan Martell would love to have his tag team partner back, but no tag match tonight, Corbin. This is a singles match. No, right now it is all about Miles Jacobs. No, stop it. Really, Miles, you, we, we've discussed this. You know, Miles right. used to be uh, a good friend of mine. And now he's not. He's he's turned his back on his friends. He is now Michael. all about winning at all costs and Michael. keeping that title around his waist. What is wrong with winning? There's really nothing wrong with winning except when you cheat to win. Nobody's cheating. No, here we go again. Anyway, we're going to watch this match. Let, I mean, obviously, uh, I, I like Brennan Martell in this. I think he's got the speed and the agility to beat Miles Jacobs. Oh, my goodness. What a slap. And it's just like he snaps right there. Just repeated shots. Now he throws Brennan across into the turnbuckle. Look out. Full head of steam. Oh. Oh, oh my goodness. Brennan. That's going to put a smile on your face and leave it there. Brent, well, for depending on who you're rooting for, Brennan down. Up on both knees. And oh, my. What a right hand from Miles Jacobs. Now he's helping Brennan back up. Here we go. Now, it's, see, he's got him over that rope. He's choking him out, Corbin. He's stuck in helping him, Michael. Oh, my gosh. He was dizzy. He fell into the ropes, and there was Miles Jacobs helping him out. What oh, my. Throwing his head into guy. that top turnbuckle. Miles Jacobs showing no mercy to Brennan Martell. Brennan may have been gone a while. There, there's no sign of ring rust. Miles Jacobs just taking control of this match very quickly and just annihilating his opponent right now that's right hey michael yeah we've said it twice yeah it's important to say it again sure 
If you like this, you're gonna love the art of war. <laughs> there it is. August 14th. I think you're getting a plug. You get paid every every time you say it. That's what I'm thinking. But yeah, August 14th tickets on sale now. There's still front row seats available. Twelve dollars for general admission. Eighteen for the front row. Limited oh, supply though. Oh, 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 Brennan. Brennan Marcel oh. may not make it. To Brennan the art of war. What of war. a clothesline. There's a cover. One, two. Brennan able to kick out. My goodness. Oh. What a shot. And now Miles just pummeling him on the mat. Now he's choking him out, Corbin. Not choking him. Uh, that's a his choke. shoulders down. Oh, stop it. I'm going to buy you a rule book so that you can see the difference between helping and cheating. That's it. That's it. Now I know what I'm getting you for Christmas. Oh, yeah? Yeah. And when I highlight the key parts and give it back to you, you'll uh -oh. know also. <laughs> oh my goodness, what a slam. Oh wow. Oh my goodness. Brennan Martell probably not wanting to be in this match now. I mean, Miles Jacobs using his size, using his strength to not his cheap. advantage. Well by you. Using your size. Hey, and down strength. in front. Down in front, sir. I can't see. Well, what you're missing is Brennan Martell just Gasping for air as, uh -huh. Miles Jacobs. as Miles was choking him in the corner. No, Miles Jacobs, he was standing. Uh huh. His hands weren't anywhere near him. Uh huh. Sure. Anyway, all right. Oh, Brennan trying to fight out. Brennan showing signs of life, maybe. Repeated shots to the midsection of Miles Jacobs. Again, sir, down in front. Can we get security here, please? Security? Anybody? Well, I don't think you're missing much. I just think you're missing the last oh, few my goodness. of Brendan Martell's life. A repeated knee shot there. Now, Miles has him in the ropes. He's going to send him across. Look out. Oh, Brennan! Oh. Brennan! Hit him with the crossbody! This could be exactly what he needs, Corbin. It could be. We're, of course, Brennan. not going to know. Springboard wow. moonsault! The cover one, two! And oh. what a violent oh kick out. Miles. Brennan actually lands on the official. Miles Jacobs just picked him up. Threw him from With the ground. Authority, what a kick out. My goodness gracious. Referee slow to get up. Brennan now on his feet. Miles dazed and confused. He's now getting to his feet. Brennan Martell. Here we go. Oh no. There was a low blow, Corbin. There was a low blow. Well, you missed it because that guy was there. What happened was Brennan Martell tried to get the kick on Miles Jacobs, missed. Oh no! Oh no, down goes Brennan. There's a, a cover, but I can't see it. One, two, oh, and it's three. Finally, the gentleman moves out of the way. For the win, Miles and Jacobs. Still RCW All-American City Champ. Miles Jacobs, your winner. But don't go anywhere. Don't go anywhere. The main event coming up next. for a job I mean seriously do you want a job then get a hold of ASAP staffing ASAP staffing is located in Barberton Ohio 165 2nd Street Northwest phone number is 330-203-3106 would you like to see your commercial aired on both RCW Spotlight and RCW Global Contact us on social media at facebook.com slash Rubber City Wrestling, Instagram at Rubber City Wrestling, or email us at the RCW Network at gmail.com. All right, Corbin, it is time for the main event of the evening. One half of the RCW Tag Team Champions, James Lethal in singles action tonight, Corbin, versus Lottery, the newest signing to the RCW Whoa. roster. The hottest signing to the RCW uh, roster. The, the dude is killing it in independent wrestling right now. For him to come to RCW, that's a huge, huge game for RCW. Well, we'll see. I mean, I've heard Lottery is friends with the role model, Rick Lieb which is why he wanted to sign with RCW. We know James Lethal. 
So we know. Right, so we already know not to have our hopes up too high. Oh, right. Okay, you're going to say that to one half of the current tag team champions. Here's the thing. No, here the we last go. time I saw James Lethal, he was on his back getting beat up. In the interview, he decided to run his mouth. I just said, hey, man, I respect you, but I got a job to do. I call it as I see it. And then, boom, out of nowhere, Fire and Ice come. No, I, we won't get into that at all. But right now, lottery in the quarter. But look at that nice, clean break by James Lethal. No extra cheap shot, nothing, just a general clean break. Well, he's testing the waters. What do you mean he's testing the waters, Corbin? He's testing the waters. You don't want to see. No, as you now, get lottery out. pushing he's James lottery. back Showing in the corner. Him. Oh, and a clean break. Okay, I like it. It's, it's testing the water. So just getting amped up. Here we go. In, in the corner, chatting, chatting with the camera guy there. I mean, I'd pay attention more to your opponent than the camera guy, but, you know, hey. Lottery's coming in. So you probably don't know this, but Lottery already has a rivalry with Spike St. James. Yeah, they have had many of matches in that independent circuit, so... I can't wait to see the two of them in a match here at RCW. I mean, I kind of like Spike St. James in that match, but we'll see. Maybe someday. Got to break it up. Not, oh, not such a clean break. There. Not, not, not a clean break. He might have accidentally got lethal. Oh, repeated shots. It's good to see our favorite athlete, Joe. Yeah, Joe's back. Hey, Joe. Joe is in the ring. Lethal not lethal looking down. so good. Down on both Trying knees. To hold on to the ropes. Lottery, what a wow. right hand. Another one. How about a third one? A fourth one. Good grief, number five. Every bit of that five seconds while he's tied up in the ropes. Oh my goodness. James Lethal comes out of the corner, stumbling, bumbling, fumbling down on his knees. Good Stay grief. Locked up in the ropes because right now Lottery is just side headlock. Oh, another punch again. Chatting it up with the with the camera guy. James Lethal needs to show some offense here. Lottery, all offense, all serious right now. Oh my! What a slap! What a chop across the chest repeatedly. James Lethal is down, Corbin. I'm not used to seeing this at all out of James Lethal. I'm a bit concerned. You should be. Lottery, a hot. Come on, I'm telling you, the hottest. Newest name in the RCW. Now we're going to get to know him. Again, talking to the camera guy, I think he should be focusing more on his opponent, putting him away. His opponent's unconscious. Oh, my goodness. Side headlock again. James Lethal. Oh, James Lethal able to send Lottery across. Goes for that vicious clothesline. Misses. Oh, back elbow finds its mark. Lottery hits the elbow. Oh, here we go. Choking out. Nope. A little rope burn across the face. Burn. Oh my goodness, that does not feel good at all. James Lethal, very little offense in this match, Corbin. Lottery is here to make a name for himself. Yeah, you gotta really respect what he's doing out there. Nice, clean match, just manhandling Lethal. It's good old fashioned RCW wrestling. Uh -huh. Anyway, Lottery's got Lethal in the that corner sending him across no lethal reverses it lethal firing it oh wow oh he didn't get all of it corbin but i think he got enough lottery sliding out of the ring that swinging neck breaker joe has started the count where are you going lottery lottery get back in the ring buddy goes down just go jump on him five Referee is up to, on he's up to six, seven. James Lethal now to his feet. Oh, Lottery slides back in. Oh, he's going after Lethal. Here we go, all oh, Lethal. Great ring, ring awareness. Oh, there's the boot. Fisherman suplex. Yes, he hits it. The cover one, two, and three. Carmen, there is your winner, James Lethal. Uh oh, look at Lottery. Clearly not happy with that win, and probably rightfully so. That was probably the cheapest shot I've ever seen on a lethal. Are you serious right now? What a fisherman suplex. What a victory. He, lottery wasn't even looking. For James Lethal. Ladies and gentlemen, this does it for episode 64 of RCW Global. Signing off for Corbin Shadow. I am Michael Voorhees, and we will see you next week.